Cobbiz. Hello everyone, this is Yash Saxena and you are watching Cobbiz. In this video, we are going to talk about how to obtain PESO certification in India. For those who don't know what PESO or PESO stands for, it is Petroleum and Explosive Safety Organization, commonly known as Department of Explosives, since 1898 and serving the nation by regulating the safety of hazardous substances such as explosives, petroleum and compressed gases. To regulate and control the use of fuel stations and explosives in India, the curve the government of India established the Petroleum Explosive Safety Organization. The organization grants permit to operate petrol stations under Form 14 as well as licenses to operate petroleum products, vehicles and petrochemical complexes. The department is led by the Chief Controller of Explosives and is based in Nagpur, Maharashtra. So what are the objectives of PESO? The main objective of PESO is to ensure public safety in the areas of manufacturing, storage, handling, transport etc. of petrol and explosives, carbide of calcium, flammable substances and compressed gases. It plays advisory role in safety to the government and semi-government bodies like railways, defense establishments and ministry of surface, transport, environment and forest ports, petroleum natural gas pollution, control authorities etc. Coming within the purview of Explosives Act 1884 and Petroleum Act 1934, the rules framed there under. Framing standards concerning public safety in collaboration with the BIS, OSID and other apex bodies and harmonizing Indian standards with international standards, assessment of new technologies, finding applications in the hazardous area for adoption in indigenous conditions, creating safety awareness amongst the public. PESO is involved in the regulations of over 2,56,000 premises all over India. These were the objectives. Who needs this certification? Let's talk about them. Explosive manufacturing factories, explosive storage premises, firework manufacturing factories, gas cylinder filling plants, petroleum storage installation petroleum pipelines, LPG bottling units, petroleum service stations, etc. The Petroleum and Explosive Safety Organization, often known as the PESO, Certificate of India, describes the obligatory approval program for the gases and oil sector or machines that deal with the gases used in the oil industry or must survive very corrosive conditions. Products with IECEX or ATEX certificates are necessary to get PESO due to the often extremely risky nature of product that comes under PESO organization who wants to have their products certified must exercise greater caution. What products are converted under PESO? Valves, gas cylinder regulators, storage facilities for filling gas cylinders, generating plants, factories for the manufacture of fireworks, warehouse and shops for firework, long distance petroleum pipelines, explosive factories for the production of explosives, storage rooms for explosives, LPG filling station, flame proof equipment etc. As we have discussed about the objectives and basics, then why it is needed by us? Bad quality of critical products can lead to loss of life. Establishing preliminaries for fire safety, formulating safety guidelines for manufacture of equipment, the safety of the explosive industry cannot be ignored. The explosive product needs oversight. Machines used in this industry also require regulation. This was the brief about PESO and why it is required. Moving forward in this video, we are going to talk about the most important part that is the process and the documents needed. For PESO certification, you would require to submit the following documents. Applicant's document, application form, contract with AIR for a minimum of 5 years, technical, competency proof, etc. Plant and AIR business license of manufacturer, global organization chart, product IECEX or ATEX certificate, QAR or QAN test reports, manufacturer profile, list of product equipments and test instruments, ISO certificate, video of the production facility. Commercial information includes 3 years sales figure, a list of Indian customers, hazardous area installation, information like installation location or the intended use of equipment. As we have discussed the documents and once you are ready with all of them, you can begin with the application process. Step 1 is preparation of application applicant's document, especially with IECEX or ATEEX certificate and test reports. Step 2, application is to be made at PESO authority. Step 3, the PESO authority will check the documents. Step 4, test in India only for certain products is mandatory. Step 5, only for pressure vessels, factory audit. Step 6, after that PESO certificate is issued, the certificate is valid for 2 years after it is issued and must be renewed. PESO license for static pressure vessels have validity of 3 years period and must be renewed after it. Any modification to the machine or pressure vessel must be inspected. So this was all about the topic and for more such content you can keep watching Cobb Best. This is Yash Saxena signing off. Thank you.